Hey guys, welcome back again. Today's video is about screen mirroring Android devices on Windows operating system using a tool called Scrippy. Scrippy is a free open source alternative to all the best screen mirroring software that requires users to shell out loads of money. This application provides display and control of Android devices connected via ESP or over TCP IP. It doesn't not require any root access. It works on Linux, Windows, and Mac OS. A quick overview of the features of Scrippy. Does not require a root available for Windows, Mac OS, and Linux. No app is required on phone. A high resolution mirror. Type using your computer keyboard. Interact using your mouse. Works with USB or Wi Fi. Keep in mind that this app needs strong internet connection if you are going for the wireless option to prevent blinking or slow movement. Otherwise, it works very quick by using USB cable. If it is still slow with USB, that's mean you need to check your cable strategy. Before we begin, pre-request for screen mirroring. For screen mirroring apps to work, it is necessary that you turn on the USB debugging. Located in the Android developer option, to enable developer option on your Android device, head over to your Android setting, about phone. Scroll down and tap build number 5 times. Go back to system setting. You will now see developer option. Scroll down and toggle USB debugging. How to install Scrippy on Windows and view the phone screen on PC with USB. Let's start with download SDK platform tools zip file. You can find the link in the description. Extract the zip file. Connect the device to your PC with the USB cable. Now right click on the file that was extracted and choose Run Windows PowerShell. There are three commands and one of them work on your Windows. Just keep trying one after another until you see that is connected to your device. That happens because of the different version of Windows. After that, go to this website and download the latest package of Scrippy. Extract this file under the same file of SDK platform. and choose replace the files. And we finish here, you just need to click Scrippy and enjoy the tool. How to view the phone screen on PC via Wi-Fi. In order to use Scrippy with Wi-Fi, you must do the similar steps as you use ESP. But if you have already used it before, then follow these steps. Go to the platform tool folder, right click and open the PowerShell window. Type ADB devices. If that doesn't work, change the first part of ADB. As similar as it worked for the first time. For example, ADB TCP 4.5 to enable Wi-Fi debug mode. If you do this correct, then add this command, ADB connect device IP address 4.5. Replace device IP address by your phone IP address. You can locate your Android device IP address in setting about phone IP address like mine. 
remove the SB cable and launch script using command and this is it enjoy the tool and have fun playing your games and other stuff if you face any problem don't hesitate to comment i will try to help thanks for watching see you next time